Okay, this is uh, chicken stock pressure cooking part two. And uh, so we put it up to pressure for, oh, forgot to turn my timer off. We put this up to pressure uh, to 11 pounds of pressure for um, 20 minutes. Uh, and then um, once it was done, we've taken it off the burner. That's on the same burner now because I've just put it back, but we took it off the burner and it took about 45 minutes to an hour. Uh, for this little pressure gauge to go down. Um, once that was down, we took off the rocker that was on the top and we've let it sit for 10 minutes. That's what the timer was. So we're going to take the top off and uh, hope everything went well. Okay, so that worked out perfectly. Uh, doesn't look like any of the jars broke. And we have uh, 10 jars of delicious chicken stock. So uh, I'm going to remove these um, just one by one. Again, with our little lifter here and uh, set those aside. They're very hot. Be sure you do not touch those with your skin and uh, you don't want to get burnt. Um, we'll just remove all of these uh, and generally let them cook over, or no, sorry, cool overnight and uh, they're ready to go. Once that's all done, uh, what I'll do is I'll just put those little stickers on that I showed you earlier and take them down to, whoops, sorry, <laughs> take them down to uh, my. Uh, canning room so I will show that to you so you can see some of the things I do uh, we'll be doing much more canning this year so uh, as that goes along um, I'll do more videos on how to can so I hope you've enjoyed this videos uh, if you did uh, pass it along uh, hit, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and um, yeah hope to have lots more videos for you soon thanks for watching